Namaste and good morning. Welcome to today's pranayam session. Let's begin. So sit comfortably wherever you are, on the floor or on a chair. Just sit up nice and tall. And begin to bring your awareness to your breath. Relax the shoulders, keeping the chin up. Bringing your awareness to your Manipur Chakra, so your solar plexus. Keeping Gyan Mudra. Taking a very deep breath in. Holding it for a second and exhale. Hold. Inhaling. Hold. Exhale. Hold. So we're doing a box breathing, which is when you inhale for four counts, you hold for four counts, you exhale for four counts, and then you hold for four counts, okay? So we're going to have moments of absolute stillness at each end of our inhale and exhale, okay? Purak and Rechak. Now just go at your own pace, take it very gentle. If you need to reduce the number of counts you're holding your breath for, that's absolutely fine. But just relax, relax into your body and enjoy this rhythmic breath. Keep going. Keep going while I speak to you. <clears throat> so just to reiterate, you're breathing in deeply, expanding your lungs for four counts. Then you're just remaining still, keeping that breath inside you for four counts. Then you slowly and steadily exhale through the nostrils for four counts. And then you remain there still without any movement for four counts. And then you gently repeat the process. As you inhale, your shoulders should be down, your back should be straight. So don't raise the shoulders when you inhale. Expand the lungs and then contract back in. Feel your lungs slowly rise and then slowly lower. We're working at increasing the strength of our lungs as well as the capacity to absorb oxygen. Keep going. Keep going. I deliberately didn't play any background music this morning because I want you, <clears throat> excuse me, to enjoy the silence. 
the space in between the breaths, the silence within the body, the opportunity to listen and absorb and be in the presence of your body. This is a very calming breathing exercise that you can do any time you need to, whether you want to just relax or um, if you're feeling any kind of anxiety or if you feel that you're not in control of your breath, this is a very gentle and soothing way to connect. Bring the hands in front of you, so just interlock the fingers and just place them low near your groin as if you're um, engaging with your lower chakras. And slowly, slow down the breathing even further. Come back to a normal rhythm of breathing and just enjoy the quiet. Listen. Now we are going to inhale for four, but exhale for eight, okay? Let me demonstrate. Okay, so we're breathing in fully and expanding the lungs and then we're exhaling slowly and absolutely fully. Okay, and if you want to pause at the end of that pause, remember to do this at your own pace. So very gently, sitting up lovely and tall, taking a lovely Long expanding, inhale for four counts. And exhale for eight. Keep going. So if you feel that your lungs are exhaling the air very quickly, you can begin to draw the air from your abdominal. Okay, so if you release the air from your chest, then you can start to pull in. Yeah, so you're really expelling all the air from your body. Keep going. Mm -hmm. 
I am also beginning to adopt Ujjayi Pranayam, which is the sound at the back of my throat during my exhale. So if you listen carefully, Okay, so it's almost like people say it's like an ocean sound in the back of the throat. And I have an Ujjayi tutorial, which you can watch and practice. But um, don't force yourself to make this sound. Let the air come from the depth of your body and the Ujjayi breath will naturally follow. Okay, so try with me. We're still inhaling for four and exhaling for eight. Keep going. You can see that the more your uh, throat warms up, the easier it will become to access the Ujjayi Pranayam. Keep going. And if you don't want to do the Ujjayi, that's absolutely fine. Just continue inhaling for four, exhaling for eight. Now I want you to begin doing a very slow uh, Kapubhati, very, very slow. So, Keep going while I talk. So everything is absolutely still. You are just focusing on inhaling in which the stomach is expanding and then exhaling through the nose and squeezing the tummy in. So this is more abdominal breathing rather than thoracic breathing. So we're going... So 
So it's almost like a ratio of two to one. You're inhaling for two, exhale for one. Inhale for two, exhale for one. going to speed up a little bit. Now I want you to decrease the size of your inhale to make the exhale more prominent. Now we're going to stick on the exhale. So we're doing the similar inhale for four and exhale for eight pattern again. Except this time we're engaging in Udhyana Bandha, so we're really drawing in our stomach. So this is more abdominal base. So we inhale for four and then exhale for eight. To be honest, that is more of an inhale for four, exhale for four, hold for four. Because with the Udhyana bun, you can only exhale so much. So let's try that with the correct count. And relax. Excellent work. Well done. We're going to finish with an inhale up for four and then an arm, a longer arm, so approximately eight. But go at your own rhythm and your own pace. Saying arm is also a form of pranayama which will help you connect with the divinity within us and all around us. So begin to bring your awareness to your third eye chakra, your Ajna chakra, and really bring your awareness to your crown and just engage with the vibrations of all. Let's do two more. Oh. 
To that box breathing we did at the beginning. Slowly rub your hands together. Rub your or press the palms of your hands over your eyes. Pressing your thumbs into your earlobes, chanting all one more time whilst covering your eyes. Oh. Bring the hands back to Brahmasan. Rubbing the hands together, placing the palms over your eyes once more. Take a deep breath in. Exhale. Bring the hands down to Pranam Asan. Gently and slowly begin to open your eyes and have a wonderful day. Take care of yourself. See you next time. Namaste.